Hi everybody, this is Jennifer with Family Adventures Overlanding and on this episode of Base Camp Basics, we are making Philly Cheese Steak Stuffed Peppers. So for this recipe, we're going to be using onion powder, garlic powder, some seasoned salt. We're gonna need a little bit of olive oil, salt and pepper. If you wanna omit the salt because you're using seasoned salt, that's fine. You're gonna need three green peppers, one onion, a container of sliced mushrooms, any mushroom that is your preferable mushroom is fine. And then you're also gonna need about a pound of steak and you're gonna want it really thin for these um, stuffed Philly peppers. I usually get a shaved steak, but they didn't have it, so I got thin ones. And then um, I cover mine with provolone cheese slices. You can use any cheese slice that you want. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna prep my vegetables and meat. And what I'm gonna do is with my green peppers, we're gonna go ahead and um, cut them in half. We're gonna go ahead and go long ways, take the seeds out. We're gonna dice up our onion, and then we're just gonna do a rough chop on our mushrooms. And even though this is a thin steak, I'm gonna go ahead and just cut it in thinner slices. So I'm gonna go ahead and take care of that and then we'll get cooking here in a minute. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do once we have all of our vegetables prepped and our meat cut up, or if you used um, the shaved steak, you don't have to prep anything with that, is we are gonna put a little bit of water on the bottom of our scottle. I probably have about a cup of water in here. We're not gonna use all of it because all that we're going to be doing here is we're gonna turn our scottle on probably medium heat because what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our green peppers that we have cut in half, cleaned out the centers, washed them, prepped them, ready to go. That has a little water in it still, which is fine. But what we're gonna do is, either way, you can either lay them that way, or if it's easier, go ahead and lay them that way. We're just gonna go ahead and steam them for a little bit, probably just a few minutes. All that you wanna do with the green pepper when this process is, we just wanna make it a little bit tender. You don't wanna make it really soggy and wet. We still want it to hold its um, shape because we're going to be stuffing them. So we just want to make them a little bit soft so when you eat them they're not real crunchy. Once I have the water on, green peppers on top, we're going to go ahead and we're going to close it until we start to see steam come up around our lid. This one needs another piece of steak. Okay, two, get in there. All right, so let's check on these. The cheese is pretty well melt melted. As it was sitting here, um, we started to smell the green peppers cooking, so I turned the heat off to the scottle and just let the heat inside finish melting the cheese down. If you're noticing that the cheese isn't melting down and the green peppers are starting to either burn or starting to really cook, you can add a little bit of water to the bottom of it and cover it and that'll help melt your cheese as, your cheese as well too. You just kind of have to play around with it depending on your weather and how cold or how hot it is outside. Um, that's part of cooking. It's just having fun, experimenting, trying things. If it doesn't work, try it again a different way. So that's all I do is I just keep experimenting with it and trying it. So we're gonna go ahead and get these dished up and get some dinner done. That is really tasty. Mm -hmm. Can't wait to see what else we make in the future, guys. We'll see you on the next video.